They don't realize that I'm not a drug addict. They don't realize that I'm trying my hardest. They don't realize that I'm just a normal guy. I'm not some, some, some homeless drug addict trash. They don't, I don't think that, uh, I don't know how to say it. Just, it's kind of, we're kind of a stain, you know what I mean? To them. Uh, the economy just went downhill and we knew that there was jobs in Branson. It's like, yes, we can work in Branson. There's always jobs. So I took my last paycheck from a job I made minimum wage at and that's 725 uh, in um, Kansas. And uh, we came here and uh, immediately found jobs. Um, we thought it was going to go a lot faster than it did. We thought we were going to have a car and have an apartment and everything a lot faster. You know, we're, we're working on what, six months or so we've been here and uh, it's just not coming together how we had planned it. It's a little harder than you think. Of course, we, between the two of us, we make enough money. We don't qualify for food stamps. Um, so even though we both work full time jobs, there's just not enough money to um, to, to pay the $700 a month I have to pay here for me and my dog and my kids. Um, there's four of us and a dog cramped in a room um, to get into an apartment it's somewhere between two and $3,000 and I just can't save up for it. I've got a, the closest place I have to go to, for food is across the street to a Latino store that is way overpriced or Walgreens. Otherwise, I've got to walk a mile and a half or pay $10 to the loop each way to go get groceries. That's the kitchen. This is where we cook at. We also have a hot plate, but we use a crock pot a lot because we can just toss it in and go to work and come home and dinner's done. Um, that's why I've got the cabbage and sausage out and I've got stew in there. But we use a, I mean, there's not much room. This is the bathroom sink. This is the kitchen sink. This is the everything sink. So uh, sometimes we wash our clothes in the tub. So, <laughs> yep, the, the pantry. <laughs> And the extension of the pantry is on top of the microwave. <laughs> I've never been in a church so accepting. I've never been in a place where when they say come as you are, it really means come as you are. I've watched a drunk, two drunk men with their dogs and all their belongings walk in, sit through the service, and what did Jesus was homeless do? What did the members do? They embraced him, they prayed for him. They didn't say, oh, get out, you're drunk. And um, I had never wanted to go to a church ever since, for several years because of the way people are treated and, the, and the, 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 the backstabbing and whatever it is that goes on at churches. Um, I walked into Jesus was homeless. I was fed breakfast. My children were fed. And sometimes, some weeks, that's the main reason we came to Jesus was homeless because we didn't have breakfast. We weren't gonna be able to eat until five o'clock that evening. Emotional. I'm gonna cry now thinking about it. Uh, I, happiest I've ever I, I've been since I've been in Branson. My daughter's got a big heart, and uh, she loves Jesus and wants to share it. And she was, I don't know, it was just one of the biggest things she's ever done in her life. So I was really, really happy with her. Jesus was homeless will help you f with your work skills and a job. When I first came down here this last time, I walked in, I needed a food handler's card to get a job so bad. That's all I needed was a food handler's card. And there weren't any funds for a food handler's card. And out of Carla's pocket, she pulls out her debit card and she gets on the computer and she paid for my food handler's card. And it's almost, was it five and a half months later, I'm still at the same place that she helped me get that food handler's card for. What does it mean to you to, that Jesus was homeless comes every week? Um, it means that, to me, it means that they're trying to spread the outward. I help them every time I can, because um, not only is it a way to make new friends, but it's a way, it's a way to, to, to um, 
spread out Jesus to everybody.